The Ogun state government says it will be planting no fewer than 2 million trees in 2024 as part of ways to preserve the environment as well as stem the tide of climate change in the state. Commissioner for Forestry in Ogun State Engineer Taiwo Olodotun made this known while speaking with these men at a tree planting advocacy campaign organized by the environmental group Waradi El Shaddai Creations in collaboration with the Ministry of Forestry and Environment as part of activities marking the 2024 World Environment Day. Represented by the Permanent Secretary in the Ministry, he said the state government has continued to place a premium on the environment as well as forest reserves by planting trees to save human lives. He further said everyone must take responsibility towards the attainment of a better society where everyone can live a healthy life. This year, we are planning also to have um, about 2 million trees planted. The state government and some, some other farmers too, and individuals too. And uh, we have started. We have started our nurseries idea. We have raised them. And uh, shortly, by next week now, we are going to kick off officially tree planting in all our forest reserves in Noble State. If you cut down the last tree, the last human being will die. That means that without trees, we cannot survive. No human being can survive without trees. So it's a business for all, not just for few. Business for all, not for few. On his part, an environmental enthusiast, Wadari Etuk, said the move behind the tree planting is to promote green infrastructure in the society. He noted that global warming and climate change is real, stressing that the time for everyone to take action is now. He said the organization aligns with the ideals of the United Nations, thereby taking steps to restore and preserve the environment. The environmentalist also added that if nothing happens, the earth will be too hot for habitation. To reverse that trend, we must plant trees. Trees have the capacity to reduce the carbon in the atmosphere, which is a major cause of global warming. And that is why we are calling on everyone, male, female, young, old, children, pupils, university students, market women, professionals, bankers, we have to come together and arrest this situation. There's no better time than now, before the earth gets too hot for us to support life. So we have to come together, support the government. Government cannot do it alone. We all contribute us to global warming, so we have to come together and reverse the trend. And it has to be now, it has to be decisive. It has to be purposeful. We must save planet Earth. Planet Earth is crying for us to rescue it. And no better time than now. And the advantages of this tree planting includes, um, we know that trees bring out oxygen for humans and it also helps with respiration. It creates a more safer and greener environment for its inhabitants. And it's also used for paper. Trees produce pulp, which is used for papers, and these papers are what we use nowadays. Even students, they use papers to take their notes. Even all these newspapers we see nowadays, they are gotten from trees. So trees are very, very important, and I think we should, we should improve more on afforestation and planting of trees in Nigeria. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel, and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.